Hello guys, I am Ankit from Learners Channel and I will take you through the adventurous journey of app development on Android platform. Mark the word adventurous, cause at the end of this tutorial you will understand the reason for which I use this word. Let us begin this adventure from downloading and installing Android Studio. Android Studio is an application which is provided by Google. Initially it was provided only to the developers group but now it is available for everyone. So this is the link where you can get the Android Studio app. You can uh, directly download it from this button. You just need to accept terms and conditions and then you are ready to go. After you have accepted it will take you to the install guide page so you can also see the installation process from there uh, let me show you one more thing which is interesting android studio is available for all uh, os that is three files are available for windows operating system and there's one file for linux operating system and also you get one for mac os so here you can see if I remove this yeah here you see there are uh, one for Linux one for Mac and three for Windows operating system so to make things simpler I have already downloaded the app so let me pause this and go back there yeah this is the app let's try to install it This will take a bit time because this software is uh, too big it's 1.6 GB in size and the reason for which this software is too big is uh, Android Studio provides you the SDK and ADT inbuilt which is not available in Eclipse. Eclipse is also a, uh, you can say it's a editor where you can edit and you can also create Android apps so but you have to install the ADK and SDT separately it's not available there. So here it is asking me to uninstall the old version because I am already having a version of Android Studio. So I will skip this but in your case you can just directly accept the agreement, select the de desired location and install the app. So let's get started with Android Studio. Again this takes time. This will take a bit more time in your case because it will be the first time that the application will be launched on your system. creates a virtual environment for the application to run on so it takes a bit time so now we are ready to go here we can start coding the app this is the link for from which we can just start the android studio project so thank you guys to get regular updates about the channel subscribe to the channel